Hey everyone, it's Grandma Scratch here with a Money Saving Tip. So, um, I'm literally filming in my car right now because I forgot to film this tip at home before I came up to return my Amazon stuff. So, as you know, we had a cat that got surgery um, and we needed to have a cone for her. And the cone they gave us was like the hard plastic thing and she hated it. So, I got on Amazon and I ordered a donut and it's isn't it cute because it's like a real donut and it goes around the neck and then like some little cat onesies which is absolutely ridiculous i know um but i wanted to have stuff at the house in case we needed to put something back on her because she was hating the cone um and i knew we probably weren't going to use it so clearly i didn't open it left them sealed knowing that i was probably going to return them but here's the money saving tip even if you don't have a cat even if you don't need a donut and some onesies you should always if you're returning something to amazon when you click to return on the app or on the thing, at the bottom, there's like a little line that says, um, see other items you can return or return more items. And you can click and you can see everything, <clears throat> excuse me, still recovering, that you can still return. You're likely to just say, forget it, I'll hang on to it, it's no big deal. But those items add up over time. So especially when we were remodeling the house, I'd do that a lot. I'd be like, I'd have this one item, I'm like, no, we're getting our 50 bucks back for that. But then I would scroll through and go, oh, here's like a $5 item and a $2 item. We didn't use any of these either. Let me do all of this. Because if I'm gonna go up to return one item, I'm gonna go up to return everything I'm not using and get all my money back. So make sure you always check for other items that you've forgotten that you really wanted to return. I'm not talking about cheating the system. I'm not talking about lying. If you've used an item, you should keep it. But if there are other items that you just didn't return because you thought it was a small amount of money or not worth your time, you should definitely always scan and make sure you're returning everything that you haven't used that you can legitimately get a refund on. Hope that helps you out.